Hello, welcome back to Just One Look. So today we're looking at Survivor Squad. Now this is just a little game you can pick up for relatively little off of Steam. And it's quite good. So let's start a new game. And we'll start the campaign. So there's also various different modes. That's basically a zombie apocalypse game where you control up to four different survivors at the same time collect resources and just try and survive so this is the tutorial so left click on your man then right click to move you can see here is the line of sight which is very important. So if anything cre crept up on him, on him here, it would just kill him. He wouldn't see it or be able to fire at it. So you need to place your people with covering fire, cover all directions. So let's just move the camera around before he moved when we do this. No, not yet. So it's quite simple looking, but it does the job. So here's your inventory, what weapon you've got equipped, armor, etc. And your health bar. And a zombie. So, open the cabinet to search. You don't have a weapon? Well, look in the cabinet. Well, of course, everybody always keeps a weapon in a cabinet just here. So, there was an infection, the world's gone mad, zombies everywhere. I heard there's a scientist somewhere in a secret lab working on a cure. So, let's search in a minute when it lets me. If you want to help, scavenge for supplies and stick with me. Definitely a good idea. Okay. So I think we've got more ammunition. So let's bring him around here, to cover down the bottom here. Select Steve. So you can look through wi windows. search through this. He's found scrap which is a construction material for making other things of course. More scrap. It's got gas. So that's from there. Nope. It's all done. So this game's all set up with these mini levels rather than one large open map. But it works quite well. So let's just cover the door and go through. Keep you down there. Okay, that looks safe. Let's keep facing that door. Bring this fellow down here. Can't search the beds. Let's have a look outside, it's all clear. Let's try these doors. So there we are, that's that little level done. So this is the map you have these nodes and you can go from one to the other if they're connected to where you've already successfully finished. So this is now blue because we've done this. 
So the scientists are somewhere to the east, so we've got to work our way along. At the moment this is like our base, which we will, I think can be attacked, but I don't think this one will. I think we'll get quite a few further along before there's an attack on one of these nodes which we've captured. So, there's our resources at the top here. So not a lot. So you need gas to travel and food to keep the survivors alive. If you run out of either, you die. So basically, craft other weapons and things. You can also find actual weapons and helpful tips. That's the basics. Find the scientists. So off we go to number one. So we can change our loadout for our supplies. So we've only got one gun. Let's just give him that. So this is our bank, this is where all our usable supplies will be. So this is the visibility. I'm not sure you can skip a day. I assume that must be the date perhaps. Let's render. This is the graveyard of members who die. So we've only got two on our team. And we'll move out. Oh, we've got level up. There's also these little talent trees. Which I think it just automatically goes up, perhaps. Not, they're not actually selectable. I'm not sure. I can't remember. But anyway, let's move out. So we moved on to our next little map. So basically each time you just got to clear the area and gather the supplies. Ready. It does tend to be rather dark in this game most of the time for some reason. An awful lot of night. Ready, I'm going. Got it. I'm going. On the way. On the way. Let's just I'm check going. around this corner. On it. Okay, looks clear. Move it. Got it. Ready. Let's Move have it. a quick look up here. On the way. I'm go got it. Okay, way. let's go to the door. On the way. On to the, the door. Way. On the way. Let's see what's inside. Hmm. Move it. So noise will attract zombies. So let's cover the door. Search here. On it. I'm going. So you don't have that much inventory space, even if you've got a backpack. Okay. Yes. Got it. Yeah. So obviously med kits are quite handy. Yes. You can make most things that you find. On, on. On the way. Got it. On the way. Oh. On it. Go. Yeah, moving. On the way. On. Yes. Moving. On it. Go. So you can see them making noise. On. He's good. So let's use the knife for this guy. So they do act by themselves, so you don't just have to micromanage everything. Not sure where the door is here. Oh, search that. Creedy blueprint. 
Oh, is that a gun? I can't recall. Okay, let's get him to pick it up. Where is he? So, let's open the backpack. Let's get rid of that, and let's get. Ready, got it. Yeah, got it, got it. On it. Get that bl blueprint. Got it. Ready on the way. Got it. On it. Okay, let's travel. Oh. oh dear. So his inventory is now full. Yes. I'm going. Yes. Moving. You basically have to decide what you want to take and prioritize because there'll be far more more than what you can carry. On it. Moving. 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 Ready. Got it. Moving. Moving. On the way. Moving. Hmm. On it. On the way. So there's a zombie over here. That's it, this zone is cleared. So now we just gather up what supplies we want. I think that's the outside, so it's pretty much done. Let's just check in here. Okay, let's get the other guy. I oh, know he's full, so we've got yes. quite a lot of scrap. Let's mm -hmm. let's drop some scrap. Yes. yes, ready. Okay, I need to click and hold. Yeah. Now oh, is that only one slot? Yep. Mm -hmm. On it. I could do with another gun. May well be we can make one with the scrap. Backpack full. Okay, On the way. so we're all done. On the way. On it. Ready. Yeah. Mm. So press tab and see what we've got and what we need. So basically, not a lot at the moment. Hmm. I'm going. Got it. Moving. On the way. On it. Got it. Moving. Moving. Got it. On it. Yes. I'm going. On it. Moving. So, do we wish to leave? Yes, we're all done. So there we are, Creedy Blueprint is a gun. So we might be able to... to make it. Oh, we haven't leveled up, that's why. I assumed the level up there meant we had, but no, of course not, we haven't. Silly me. So, now you can see we have different nodes to go to. I think it's randomised. I think it was different when I've played before. So, different levels of danger, different le amounts of gas you need to get there. So, let's go to craft. So, the creed is better. Didn't realise we already had those. So we need more cloth for that. We've only got one. So let's build a creedy. And then we can equip that next time we go out. So all of these nodes, once you've cleared them, can be attacked. And if, you, if you've got somebody stationed there, you can defend with it. I don't know if it, attacks only come from infected nodes. But anyway, so there we are. That's Survivor Squad. There's quite a lot to it. You can make quite a lot of things. It may get repetitive eventually, I think, but... When you've got four characters to control at the same time, it's pretty decent. I do like it. really have to play it some more. So, 
Bye-bye for now, and we'll see you again next time.